The Seth Mazalia murder trial resumes tomorrow. Star witness Kat McDonough will take the stand once again. Our Kristen Carosa has more on what the case, on the case, and what a local expert is saying about McDonough's testimony. Kristen. Yeah, Kat McDonough testified for a ninth day on Friday, and she heads back to the stand tomorrow for a tenth day of questioning. A local expert we spoke to says the amount of time she's been on the stand is very rare. As soon as he pulled it over her head, I could just feel the energy in the air change, and I knew that he had gone. Kat McDonough, the star witness in the Seth Mazalia murder trial, listened to tape testimony Friday. Jurors heard the recordings as part of the state's redirect, which was recorded four months after Lizzie Marriott's death. The cross-examination has been uh, very, very thorough, very, very organized, and uh, fairly effective. Mazalia's ex-girlfriend has been on the stand for nine days. Defense attorney David Ruoff, not involved in this case, said it's unheard of to have a single witness on the stand for this long. He says it demonstrates how key her testimony is to the defense in the case and the prosecution. I was um, a BDSM submissive to him, so I did what he said. If he said I had to do it, I, I did it. McDonough says she had nothing to do with Marriott's murder, but admits to helping destroy evidence. She says she had no choice but to help Mazalia get rid of Marriott's body due to fear she would be harmed. The testimony um, of this one witness has been on the witness stand now for now nine days it has been epic. Ruoff says the case rests on whether the jury believes if McDonough has been telling the truth on the stand or when she spoke to the defense following Mazalia's arrest. McDonough has testified that Mazalia strangled Marriott, but during cross-examination, the defense played a recording of McDonough saying Marriott died during a consensual sex act. So it's really a question of not which story do they believe, the one before or the one now, but whether or not she's credible at all. Mazalia's trial will continue this week. McDonough's testimony will resume Monday. I would expect probably another day and a half, maybe two days. And that's just from McDonough's testimony. The judges told the jury that the trial is taking longer than expected. There's the possibility it could run into the week of June 23rd. Reporting live, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.